Hey guys, in this video, I will be talking about the bots you could get for free and the bots you could get when you pay for them. Sorry for the mic quality in this video, I am using a smartphone to record all the audio you're hearing right now. Anyhow, without further ado, here are the top free and paid TF2 trading bots. So the first bot we will be looking at is the Backpack.tf Automatic Bot. This bot is made by Srabwin and has been updated since by other coders, the latest one being Jessica's. So you just download the latest ones. Yeah, then once you're after once you're finished downloading that, extract it and you'll end up with these files and folders. In order to open the most important file, the automatic.bat, you'll be needing a another application called node.js. If you haven't had it installed yet, install it. Choose whatever bit your computer runs in my case it's 64 so I'll download that one once you have it downloaded just open it then you'll be prompted to put your username and password also plot that in and you're good to go second bot is the bizarre.tf bot this bot is pretty straightforward so in order to use it go to go to your bizarre.tf profile I haven't logged in yet so I'll log in yeah, so go to your trades and go to buy now. Then you'll scroll down. Then you'll see create an, a trade or whatever. And so that's basically what I did. More info about this will be in the description. Just, just look at it. So that's the bot. Next bot will be the a DIY bot. Make it yourself or do-it-yourself bot many there are many foundations of trading bots online the one the most common one which a lot of other bots are running on is Jessica's Jessica 96 steam bot yeah so you just clone or download the, the files download zip out of that, just extract it like you did with the backpack.tf one. Then you start coding once after that. Many tutorials on YouTube explain and teach how to make your own. So just look that up. L look on those. Next one is the trade.tf bot. This one is a, an also very nice bot. So you have to be in trade.tf in order to use it. Once you close trade.tf, your bot will also close. So first, add an extension to your Chrome or whatever site you use. Chrome is the best, in my opinion. So the extension Tamper Monkey will be there. Just add it. After you're finished adding it, you reload your trade.tf page. In my case, I wasn't able to go back to my trade.tf page, so I had to make a new tab for it yeah, so that's what I did and now I'm just gonna reload it after that get the latest robot plugin version so press on install robot then you'll install the, a, la a series of code to temper monkey with that reload your page then your bot will be good to go first yeah you also press start bot and you'll be prompted with this question or a message by Tamper Monkey. Here I was kind of dumb, I didn't know what to do, so I just kept uh, pressing allow once. What you're supposed to press is don't act again. It'll stop popping up. Yeah, just watch my stupidity here until I actually figure it out. And there, I actually figure it out. Don't ask again, and boom. The, it won't pop up anymore. Next bot is the bot.tf. Everyone knows this. It's the bot site where you have to pay about, I don't know, five plus keys a month. However, their bots are really fast and reliable. In fact, the best bots there are. But then, of course, the only downfall is you have to pay for them. At the moment, bot.tf is out of stock. They have no bots. This is due to the high demand of bots. That's why you see more than 20 bots on backpack.df right now. 
Yeah, so that's basically all the bots. And that is the video. Thanks guys for watching. Please leave a comment if you found this video somewhat educational. Also like it. And if you do have the time, please subscribe. That will help a lot. One subscription equals one scrap to GEWP. Goop. So yeah, thanks for watching.